Hello beautiful people, my name is Nistaku and welcome back to Wolf Among Us. Today we are going to the pawn shop? The pawn shop? That's what we're doing today? Pawn shop? I think it's pawn shop. I think we're going- we are going to the pawn shop! Yes, okay, I was right. Jewelry, gold, gems, cash. Oh, what is it's that? Dirty. Oh. Malice note. It looks like you slept in it. <laughs> in a pile of garbage. Why is he trying Death, to sell that? Or you, I've seen you take a torn purse for a tenner. Yeah, but a I tenor? also got her phone number. I don't want your phone number. Oh. oh really? Oh, he works what? here. Big B's here. She glamour toe, just oh. get out too. This is a surprise. Sheriff. What if I don't say anything? I'm not trying to be mean. You need a decorative lamp? Got plenty of those. This will take two minutes and I'll be out your way. All right, let's wait. I'm not taking the coat. But it's magic. So? There's nothing magic about the coat. I'll be covering a check I already wrote. Okay, well, that sounds like a your problem problem to me. Uh, yeah, it is. And so isn't I that came face here coat? Off. Hey, wait a minute. That's Faith's coat. It was face coat. Look, you left it in my place. What do you expect me to do? I left it? Why would we yes, leave it I there? I think the off-sited statute of Finder's Keepers clearly states that it's his now, Bigby. So what's it gonna be? I don't know what to tell you. See if Cindy needs a coat. I don't know. Cindy? <sighs> this is to pay for those bloody glamours, you know. You and your blinkered rules. What, uh... If a witches didn't charge so fucking much, I wouldn't have to be in here. Ah, <laughs> uh, Snow might no help sense. you out. You know, it maybe makes Snow no sense why they charge so much. Snow help me out. Give you an advance, a loan or something. She's kind of in charge of the business office now. Yeah. Well, the last guy who was in charge didn't help us much, so forgive me if I don't expect anything different now. I get that. I don't know what you're getting so steamed about. Shouldn't be that big of a shock that I'm not gonna take an ass hair. <laughs> No, I guess it shouldn't be, since this old bleeding operation's just a setup for one of his shady fucking lies. Oh ho ho! It's me on the own lays, okay, you og fray? Oh ho, you're today, talking you about the crooked man! Oh, you turn down people's stuff so you can peddle it. Hey, you guys are a bunch of loan sharks. What talking about. Um, og fray? The crooked man, <laughs> right? This is his place. Those are his loans. Yeah. Well, I'll leave you to your business. <laughs> I'm sure you'll have a lot to talk about. Toad just read it out. Good luck with that glamour, Toad. Fuck off. Aw, poor Toad. Leave the coat. Really? How the hell do you expect me to get a glamour then? It's not like I've got a lot of options, you know. Can we give him money? Do we have money? Look, I'll, I'll give you some money, all right? You've got to be kidding me. Do you even know how much a glamour costs? It's an attempt. I've I've never had to buy one. Keep your money, Sheriff. I've no patience for charity. What? If you're gonna be out like this, can't you at least wear a bigger hat? <laughs> you know, it's getting old to tell the difference. Between what? Between the business office and fables like a crooked man, who you purportedly seek to protect us from. Either way, I'm getting screwed. Aw, Toad, I'm Drop sorry. I'm sorry, all right? There's always the fun. I'm sorry. Look, I'm sorry, all right? What else do you want from me? I'm trying! There's You're nothing really I can do if Snow's the rude one. Hey, Jack. Look, I told you I work here, and I do, okay? So don't look so surprised. That's... And before I don't you even ask, remember him saying I've that. I've never seen the crooked man in here. Neither hide nor hair and all that. In fact, as far as I can tell, he's never even actually stepped foot in here. But Bloody Mary works for him. Last time I saw her, she had the woodsman's axe. So? So the last time anybody else saw that axe, it was here. Why not ask Woody? Wait, never take something like that. Okay, you're lying. That's fun. Is this really why you came down here? <laughs> I'm asking the questions. Woodsman's That's axe? beauty. No, we don't bring up beauty. It'll lead to the crooked man. Because I don't know anything about it. Will it. Lead. That's why I came down here. It'll lead me right to the crooked man if I can track yeah. him. Yeah. He's been sending people to kill me. I'd like to have a little chat about that. Yeah! Was the axe here? No. You're lying! Are you sure? Yeah, I'm oh, sure. Oh, the headless horseman statue. He stole it. Axe. And that's saying something. If I look around? Yeah, you know, I can sometimes No, miss we don't the mention obvious. beauty, dude. Not I'm if I look around. Looking. I never miss anything. You wouldn't mind if I look around for a bit, then. And what if I did mind? There's nothing re really you can do about that, buddy. Uh, got it. Listen, I gotta start closing up shop, so, uh... Close? It's the middle of the day. 
What can I say? Jersey likes to run it on hours. And really, he'd be the one to talk to, so... I just... Can't you just swing by later? I just saw something. Really I just saw the knife, I think, that we saw at the very beginning of the game. So, uh, I'd really look around, rather tell me about physically be here if he comes back. Tell me about Jersey! You know? What else can you tell me about Jersey Devil? Just that he's a fucking psycho, <laughs> and I like to stay out of his way. I typically work when he's not here. Aw. But I can call you when he comes back, alright? Is that scary? Just Shut up, Jack. Sorry, Jack. Jersey Devil isn't here to answer my questions. It also means he isn't here to get in my way. True. So I'm gonna take a look around. As long as I've got the elbow right. I saw a knife. Right. I saw the knife. Don't let me get in your way. Oh, great. Cage. I won't. I saw... Where was it? There! Isn't that the dagger that we saw at the beginning? This is Prince Lawrence's dagger. Previously used? Who sold this? I don't know. Look, are you almost How done? How can you not know? It's sad to see you here. The dagger isn't exactly the axe, so, uh... It's just... sad to see it here. Like this. Oh, please. Sad is watching Dickory Doc sell the mouse and the clock so he can afford clean sheets. You don't know how hard most of us have it, do you? No, I don't. I know what it's like. You're better off. I know what it's like. No. I know how it is. It was a rhetorical question, but sure, fine. What is his problem? I'm not even doing anything. That's so sad, though. Um, that looks like where the axe would have been, so I'm not going to look there. I'm going to look around. I want to get all the information I can get and see if I can get any more um, fable the stories. horseman. Isn't this Cranes? <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. Oh, you don't know. He's probably just... What is that face? Why did he make that face? He's probably just going around and stealing stuff from people's dead or alive's houses to make money. What's the anvil for? Make your own horseshoes. Blacksmith didn't need it. I haven't seen him around for a while. Oh, there's a blacksmith. Oh. Uh, top prices for gold and silver. Lovely. Oh, don't look at that. Don't look at that. I want to look at this. What's this? Oh, wait. Ooh, what's that ring? Ooh, what's that crystal? That crystal looks like it was pulled straight out of Sims. <laughs> Any more rings? Hmm. This is all basic stuff. Doesn't look like any magical rings here either. It's here. Oh, <gasps> were those the darts from the bar? Wait, is this stuff that holly pond? With the horn and the darts? Because remember when Jack was looking for the darts? Maybe Jack stole hey, them. Look with your eyes, not your hands, okay? I'll do whatever I want. You can't control me. I'm looking around. Fish friend. <laughs> hey, buddy. What's wrong with us? Alright. <laughs> what? What was that? Pin cushion. Enchanted needles. Me Briar Rose. Oh. You're not touching anything are you isn't briar rose oh okay then um isn't that sleeping beauty oh new fables and what says crystal ball preconception unavailable due to crack just my luck dang all right uh is there nothing look around here sorry jack what does that say many mundy dollars mundy dollars only okay oh we could talk with them hello Nothing else you're forgetting to tell me. No. Just please don't break anything, all right? Mm-hmm. I won't break anything. But what's with this? Oh, look at this. Empty display case. Recent acquisition, huh? Oh. Cleaving act, huh? Nice. I thought you said you'd never take something like this. Nice lying. Uh, uh, so what? What's wrong right here? I, I, do, I the don't, woman uh... Jack? Uh, yeah? When was the woodsman here? Was who here? The woodsman. Oh my gosh, he sucks. Because the axe was here, but it's gone. Did he pawn it? He usually doesn't let that thing out of his sight. I don't know anything about that. I don't, really. No, I think I he mean, stole it. Day, so no, don't punch him. And even when I do work, I just try to keep my head down. Just tell me the truth. What happened to the axe? It was Mary. She took it, okay? That's all I know. She took That's the axe. You know? You don't know she almost fucking killed me with it last night? Gosh, that no. was last night. No. Why does she have this axe? Did she idea. tell you anything? She sometimes comes in to pick up shit. Where does she sometimes live? Sometimes no. it's for her. Sometimes it's for the crooked man. But I'm smart she enough wants to the, not I know the answer to this. Right? She wants the Why'd axe to take it. 
Just to fuck with me? You think I'm crazy enough to ask her that? I'm not sticking my foot in that lawnmower, thank That's you. That's true. Well, for your sake, you better think of something to tell me. That's all I can tell you. I'm being straight here. I'm just part-time. I mean, it's Jersey who's the one who's into this stuff. He's one of the crooked man's boys, okay? And it'd be great if he was here to tell you all this, but he's not. So just... Jersey, don't... Don't give me that shit. What the oh? fuck is the point of having a system if you're just gonna... my fucking system. Oh, who's you, that? You're the guy who makes sure I'm that... the guy to keep shit in order, and that's it, Woody. Who is that? Who closed the fucking gate? Jack? Hello? Wow, you look like a sleazebag. You sleaze can't you act so fucking much. Why'd you pawn it in the first fucking place, huh? I didn't pawn it, asshole. It was stolen from my apartment. And Grant said that he saw oh, it. Oh, Jack's going around Tell stealing me where it stuff. Is right fucking now. I think while well, things <laughs> Hiya, high. fellas. Hiya, fellas. Christ. And this fucking guy too? <laughs> what is Zach's even here? Nope. It isn't. Just like I said, it's not here. Happy? Gosh, what a jerk. I got shit to do, so whatever you're here for, make it snappy. I love how he has that Jersey uh, accent. He wanted to know where- Actually, you know what? I don't care what he wanted. Wait, we're not finished yet. Yes, we are. You work with the crooked man. Until I give you permission, you're not gonna do anything but answer my <laughs> questions. Uh, how's your arm? Bloody Mary leaves a bit of a sting, don't she? Jack, did you know that as of this very morning, Big Beast joined the Crooked Man's obedience school for wayward fucking creatures? He's already passed his first class. Dude. You see, the sheriff had who he stupidly thought was the murderer been chasing him for fucking days, right? But the Crooked Man snapped his bony fingers. And Bigby handed him over, just like that. Yeah, because that's how that happened. Totally didn't I'm break my uh, arm. Just gonna... Tell me uh, what you know. Let you two... There's no reason yeah, to fight with him. The man appreciated that. Tell me everything you know right now about the murders and the crooked man. <laughs> Bye, Jack. See ya. Uh-oh. Are you kidding me? It was here. It was right fucking here. Uh-oh. What did you do with it? How the fuck do I know? Listen, you bald little dipshit. <laughs> You're gonna... <gasps> Whoa. You piece of shit. Oh. Restrain Jersey. Jersey's part of all this. Freak you, Jersey. Up, Jersey. You're dealing with me now. Oh. I didn't expect to see you upright. Still looking for whoever killed them hookers? Or are you done chasing it? This is getting so tense. Where's my axe? Who'd you give it to? Back off, Jersey. You Jersey, you watch yourself. All the way from Battery fucking Park? Just so I can prove to you that your axe isn't here. And you think I'm gonna take another inch of abuse? Are you out of your fucking mind? Hey, back off and settle down. Oh, what the fuck are you gonna do? Are you kidding? You talk big, but I don't think you got the stones to back it up. He's oh my gosh. A little sore, How we? did you know? Why should Mary get all the fun? You ain't so tough. Oh, oh, it's going. Oh, it's going. <laughs> it's going. It's the pins. Oh, oh. oh. Oh, again! Yes. Oh. oh! What the hell are you doing? This is my fucking pot. You have him! now, have dog! Em. You got a lot of nerve! What did I do, Woody? Hey! 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 <laughs> oh my gosh!
Oh, oh, don't bite me. What the fuck? No, thank you. What a please. Hey, asshole. <laughs> I found them. Yes. Oh my gosh, it's so blaringly loud in my ears, but I love it. Uh, uh, not the anvil. We're not gonna be able to pick up an anvil. Right in the face! Oh! He cracked his skull! Whoa! Oh, well, that looks familiar. <laughs> Oh, Woody, you're so cool. So, wanna try again? You can't find a crooked man. No one can. What does that mean? There's no address, no place. He lives in the bends and forks of tree roots, behind the sun, in the <coughs> shadows. That's not good enough. Makes sense. Oh, the door to his house. It bounces around. Never in one spot. Oh. You'll never find it. Even Crane had to use the magic mirror. Oh. That fucking I guy. Trust you. How do you contact oh. him? Mirror, mirror. Okay, that's Crane's way. How do you contact him? Oh, I don't. He uses couriers for everything. Ravens, oh, goblins, the fucking Tweedles. Whatever. I go in when I'm taken there. You don't know anything about anything. This is so do cool. You? What do you have? Nothing. Had ah, useless bitch no white in a broken fucking mirror. No fucking friends. How do you know it's broken? You Crane know said who it. About who was really running this town? Nothing. I still have you, don't I? <laughs> it doesn't matter what you fucking do. You're not gonna get him. You wanna knock on his Fucking door and see what happens. Fine. Crane had the mirror. Bloody Mary had Crane. So take your fucking wrecking crew act to the butcher shop. The cut above. If I can find the mirror piece there, I can find the crooked man. That's her spot. That's where all the magic happens. You know what? I'm still glad we chose I'll this place leave. first. So I can find <laughs> Oh! Rest easy. Is Mary there? Why are you telling me this? If you he ain't going anywhere. Why you <laughs> Woody? Are you trying to rush me out of here? I'm trying to make a point, dog. You can have all the information you fucking want. It's not gonna help you when the time comes. And that time, it's a coming. Hmm. You got what you want. Now get the fuck out of here. Thanks, Woody. Say thank you to Woody. He helped you. Hey, Sheriff. Those girls are still dead. Oh, and there's nothing you could do to bring them back. Brother. And I don't know what they did. Shut them up. Hear them out. But I do know this. Hold on. No, I want to hear them out. Oh, if they're dead, it's because the crooked man wanted them dead. That's all it takes. So you can roar, smash the place up. <laughs> Shit. You can wail on me all you want. But what good is it gonna do you? Because he ain't in your town. You're in his. Not true. And he sure as shit is ready for you. He, you just, he just has a bunch of hitmen. Thanks, Woody. Out of smoke? Yeah, give him one. Give him one. Give him one. There you go. He literally helped you. That was the best fight we've had yet. I love it. I love it. Jersey Devil's so scary and cool. Thanks. No problem, buddy. Shitty brand. Sorry. Oh, the trip trap. Wait, the trip trap is right here? You're welcome. What? I'm not gonna lie. I was having trouble deciding which one of you to hit with this thing. Nice. Really nice. What? Jersey was wrong, you know. About what? About those. Yeah, the trip shop's right there. That makes no there sense. You can do about it. You can get the fucker who did it. Exactly. Woody, I appreciate you. 
I'm planning on it. Yeah, you're damn right it is. <laughs> All right, we'll go do it then. See you, Woody. Thank you. Man, we look rough. You gonna be okay? What's next for you? Get in the cab. See you around. I'll see you around. Hey, Woody. Yeah. I'll see you around, right? Yeah. I'll see ya. Aw. Bye, Woody! Safe travels! Oh, it's that guy again. Hello. You know where I'm going? Yep, alright. Didn't say anything to you, but you know. You must read minds. It's fine. <laughs> that bike was so cool! Oh, I love it! I can't wait to read about him now. Well, from here. Uh, stop smoking. It's not. You can't just do whatever you want. You have to be respectful. We support NYPD! America! Um. I don't know. I'm still like on the high of a fight. Now I have to look around at a stupid butcher shop. Cola, lemon lime, yummy. Love me some uh, some cola. <sighs> Big Apple Press Wellingham Cheese BLT. That sounds good. What? Uh, empty. Either he's got a whole lot of customers, or he doesn't have any. Hmm. Right. Okay. <laughs> Poor guy. Uh, ew. These are all, like, freezer burned. Not very appetizing. Ewy. Frozen solid. No, thank you. I want to eat this. Four dollars a pound, though. Jeez. Uh, okay. So we got... Oh, look at that. You can learn about the cow, guys. I don't know if you're a meat eater, but I am. So that's the rib, and the loin is the booty. Got it. All right, let's ring the bell. Hello! Bigby Wolf? <laughs> Don't mind the blood! What happened to you? I killed multiple people. I'm looking for a piece of the magic Whoa. mirror. Whoa! Um, wh what? The magic well, mirror's I guess... missing shard. Where is Why are we being like this? Bloody Mary brought it here, didn't she? Mm. What? B Bloody Mary? Magic mirror shard? <laughs> <laughs> what kind of place do you think this Listen, is? Listen, I already oh, dealt with Jack. Me. I don't need to deal with you. I'm not. What you're looking for, I I think you'd be better off looking at uh, the Lucky Pond. Yeah, or someplace I'm like that. I'm checking your place out. You know where it is, right? <laughs> it's around Been the corner there and a few blocks down. Checking your place I'll out. I'll bet you get lucky there. <laughs> I, I, I guess that's why they call it... Uh, I'm going to take a look around. You don't mind. I... Sheriff, I... Come on. Did you hear that? What? Ah! Oh, I'm real sorry. Hold on. I I just gotta go check on you. That. Freaking Don't go jerk! Anywhere. I'll be right back. Butcher. I just have to go see. You stinker! Oh, you suck. He pressed a button, Bigby. Yeah. Shit. Yeah. Wait, wait! There was a box there. Are you kidding me? There was a box. It could have. I got it covered, man. Uh, I'll be right out. No, I wanted to look at that box. It had the, uh, I think, the symbol that we saw at one of the closets. Oh, Auntie Greenleaf's closet. I'm going to help you. Enough with this. Don't talk. I, I've got a bit of a mess back here. Just be silent. Look, uh, can, can you come back tomorrow, maybe? We can figure out. I mean, don't we have a good nose? We don't need to have him. We don't need to hear him. I'm sorry, Sheriff, but you're not supposed to be back here for uh, safety purposes. Yeah, safety. Jeez, what are these cows? Good grief. Oh, damn it. Aren't you suspicious? This is disgusting. Oh, come on. That's his line of work. Let's be sneaky. Quiet and sneaky. Oh, you oh. Gotta be kidding me. To kill me. Oh god, she is gonna fucking kill me. <laughs> hey! He's gonna get me killed. 
Huh? <laughs> Hi. How you doing? Please, please, Bigby. Please don't. Bigby? What happened to Sheriff? Please don't kill me, Sheriff. I don't want to I don't want to kill him. Please. What? No. Please don't kill me. I'm not kill Please I'm not don't kill What is wrong with you? Listen, just calm the fuck down, okay? I just want some answers. I am innocent. I have okay. not killed anyone. I'm dead. Either way, they said to me, Johan, you could keep your life and lose your shop or lose both. What would you do? It was a simple choice to make in the moment. Easy, even when they got down a hook in the deep freeze. Jeez. But it's a hard one to live with. They? Do you mean Mary? Bloody Mary? This isn't my shop anymore. That crew took it from me a long time ago. Crew? Fuck. Lovely people. The crooked man's people. Lovely. Jersey Devil, D and Dumb, and that mental case, Bloody Mary. You want to talk about the real butcher? It's her, not me. This is her place. I get that. I'm telling you, they muscled in on me. Took over my storage and delivery a long time ago. All cause of that heat wave. That summer was even hotter than this one. Oh, I'd let Mary and those porkers stay cool in the meat locker one day, playing cards, having a great time. I guess they were sizing the place up. Shows what I get for being nice. Aww. I'm just a victim in this. I don't know what they think I get that. There. I swear. No, I believe you. And I don't want to know. It's all right. I believe you. Calm down. I'm not going to hurt knew him. I this would happen. Didn't know when. But there would be the day. Big B Wolf would walk through my door. <laughs> I just like hearing him, yeah. I'd catch hell for their shit. Just All that for a shop. Oh, I didn't mean to cut you off. I'm sorry. Oh, cute. Cute, cute, cute. Cute, cute, cute. Cute, cute, cute. W. Oh, we broke the lock. What the shackles? Bloody shackles? What? Oh, there's the box again. Aww. Aww. <sighs> well, he looks shocked. Nosebleed? I'm sorry? What is this place? I told you, Big P. I don't know. They muscled me out. Hmm. I swear, I don't know anything more. I haven't been back here when it was like this. I think I believe him. My cat's scratching my chair. Morning, Stop it! Lights. Go, go away. This business. You helped him escape. It's all I've ever had. You did help him escape. Damn, you can't act like you're forced into this and then turn around and help. Exactly. Him. You'd still be here if you hadn't flipped that switch up. Exactly. There. I had to. No, you didn't. You come in here making trouble for me, but you only give a shit now because the crooked man stepped on your toes or something. No. Where were you when they took this place from me? Where were you? Well, I guess Snow and Ichabod it hasn't ignored been you. Easy for me. You, you think I want to live with this yet. in my back? I'll sort this out. I needed help. Well, I'm here now. I'm gonna sort this all out. Yeah, we'll figure it out, buddy. I'm not gonna. I'm, I don't want to give him any pain. It doesn't seem like he's part of it. Mm, they would have mentioned Johan so at some is point. What Beast was delivering. Oh yeah, Glamours, how his name? Other kinds of magic. Could be dangerous stuff. Oh wait a minute. Those glamours look like no. I was gonna say it looks like the one what that Lily making? has. I'm just a butcher. You want to talk T-bones? <laughs> that I can do. This stuff is out of my league. Tongue of dog. There are a lot of nasty spells you can make with the right equipment. Jeez, jeez. Um, oh poor Johan. <laughs> he just looks so troubled. Uh, oh my gosh, there's so much. What is that? Rainbow. I like rainbows. Very pretty. These shackles. Jeez. These aren't pretty. Who's getting chained up here? You can't think I'm the only one the crooked man has under his shield. He must be chaining up witches. It's the only people who can make this stuff. That's awful. Is this what those loans get you? That crooked piece of shit. Ribbons. Chains. It's, it's all the fucking same. Yeah. Yeah, this is awful. This sucks. What's this? Maybe these are raw materials for making magic. Clear Anti Greenleaf and any other rogue witches out there probably get their supplies here. Dang. There's a lot. Innocence of Aaron? What the frick is that? Um, there's a coat down here. I want to mess with the. Okay, I guess I don't get the coat. It's fine. I didn't want to mess That's with the simple. coat. It 
What's on all the packages? What is it? That's the crooked man's uh, brand. It's on everything that goes in and out of here. Lovely. He has a brand. Well, you do know something, huh? Is that a, a wheel or what? I guess they never use that thing on wolves, huh? What's that supposed <laughs> to mean? It's from back in the homelands. A torture device. It came over here with the rest of our stories. Not that Mondays need any help coming up with that kind of thing. <laughs> yeah. It makes people crooked. By breaking their bones and... Do I really need to explain this? No. I don't think so. It's a, it's a torture device. What the hell is that? There we go. What is that? Is that the Crooked Man? Is that Bloody Mary's? I know this isn't your coat. What's it doing here? It's a coat. What's the big deal about some dirty... Looks like cranes. Oh. Some, some abuse. I'm sure he handled it just fine. Oh, that's awful. Is Crane dead? Do we even know if he's alive? No time for traveler's checks, huh? <gasps> money, 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 money. He's not using you it. You won't be needing this anymore. I'm a thief. Money, money, money. Oh, brother. Johan, I'm going through tough times too, you know. Really? Sick piece of... Really? He still has that. He took that from Lily's little uh, glamour. And there shark. it is. It's the shark. Yippee! Finally. Hey, hold on. Well, I'm real happy you found what you're looking for, Bigby. But what about me? Oh, yeah. Huh? Hi. What the hell am I supposed to do now? I'm going to have to spend the rest of my short life looking over my shoulder no, for Bloody no, Mary. No, no, no. We'll find a way to protect you. I'll take care of that. up my end. There's no way to get out of we'll this. We'll find a way to protect Report you. Go to the business office. Tell Snow I sent you there, and we'll, uh, we'll figure something out. Some kind of protection. Thank you. Thank you, Chef. He didn't do anything wrong. And there's no, re no reason to be mean. He's just a victim in all this as well. <sighs> Thanks again, Johan. <laughs> closed I would buy new locks and put those locks on the door and then slide it back down I think that's what I would do mm, okay but I'm gonna leave this here all right let's go take a look at the look at the book of fables oh I think this episode so far has to be my favorite episode this was so much fun the fight was so good oh Oh, I've been like, my, uh, Corey's been showing me a lot of, like, Dragon Ball fights and all that, especially since the new, what, Dragon Ball Sparking Zero came out. I've been watching him play that, and just, like, just some good fights and good cutscenes. Mm, beautiful. But we have five new guys. Um, the donkey skin coat. We read about this before. Hide in plain sight. Only the truly beautiful will fully understand the power of a coat that makes its wear appear ugly. It is the power to be invisible while still being seen. Fortunately, its value can also be hard to see, but it is still a magic coat, and to some collectors, that is enough. Does the magic still work, or is it like delay or dead like that ring? Briar Rose, the Sleeping Beauty. One of the few fables to find fortune in this world, Briar Rose has even turned her weakness into a strength. When her finger is pricked, it is... It not only puts her to sleep, but also those within a certain radius of her slumber? Really? This could be a powerful tool, and it's just one of the ways this Sleeping Beauty is more than just a pretty face. If only she didn't need a kiss from a prince to wake her up. Aww. So what? She... Is she asleep somewhere? I thought they were gonna say, like, she puts people to sleep and then wakes up before them and steals stuff. Oh, there he is! The Jersey Devil, Garden State Goon. Not all the fables who came to this world landed in Fable Town. There are those who scattered across the farthest corners of the earth. Oh, oh, okay. So there's not, there's still more people. And there are those who simply prefer the Garden State to the Empire State. Such a shut, such is the Jersey Devil. Reports of its appearance have varied, although most accounts make mention of leathery wings. But an encounter with a certain axe of a legend some years ago has temporarily, temporarily rendered that feature absent. Oh. 
Sub legend. So what? Did Woody cut his wings off? That's interesting. The woodsman's axe. Uh, once just a simple tool for felling trees, the axe became much more when it was ensorcelled by druids and marked with their runes. But it truly became an object of legend when the woodsmen used to slice the big bad wolf from nave to neck in protection of Little Red Riding Hood. It only... It may carry old world charm, but its simplicity of design and quality work of quality workmanship make it an effective tool or a weapon even today. Yeah, we saw that. And this is Johan, Johan the Butcher. His name is often said in the same breath as that of the baker and the candlestick maker. Oh, he's part of them. And like those other tradesmen, Johan the Butcher's storefront has served Fable Town for ages. Fresh cuts, exotic meats, and even full sides of beef for the vigorous appetites of ogres and trolls. Wow. But Johan's business has fallen on hard times and fallen in with the wrong crowd. As the quality of his products declined and his business turned into a front operation for the Crooked Man, some have started to wonder if they ever really knew Johan. Aw, that sucks. Life on the farm, we read that, so... Oh, that's it! That's it! Dang, I didn't realize I read them all that quickly. <laughs> but... That is, uh, I, I don't even know what episode number we're on, but that is this episode number. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching and all your support. I appreciate you guys very, very much. And, um... Yeah, just thank you. I hope you're enjoying this series. And we're almost done. I think we have maybe like a couple more chapters of this episode. And then we have episode 5, which is crazy. And I just can't wait for the second game to come out. I hope we get a release date soon. Um, maybe we'll look at the trailer at the end of all this. But yeah, thank you guys so much. I appreciate you all. And um, I'll see you next time. Have a blessed day, guys. Bye!